Deus Ex... I'm going to stop doing that from now on. I don't want to do that anymore. You know, it... It, that's old. Let's just go. G'day guys, how you doing? Today, I'm going to be cooking a, a, um, a, a chicken soup, but I need to get ready and stuff and prepare and all that sort of stuff. So I thought I'd do a little bit of a vlog as well. In my newly kitchen, um, not completed yet, but I haven't actually, and I've been thinking about this, I haven't done a new um, cooking segment, whatever, in my new kitchen yet. So, I will fasten this little next bit up, but uh, let's just get this set up ready and let's go. guys um, so this this goes here and what I usually do is this is so I know where shit is all my forks and knives and all that sort of stuff go in there all right so I'm gonna pull this up a bit pull it over here and this is where I'm gonna start preparing all the goodies. Let's take that, put that out of the way. Um, okay, so what's going in to the chicken soup? So, well of course, some real, real stock. I think it's, is it chicken stock? Yeah, real chicken stock. Um, we're putting this, uh, already cooked but you just have to place it in the thing and it will flavor the the juices and stuff some barbecue um chicken wings so they're going in i wanted to get one of those um barbecue chickens that we use that's what we usually do we we, we break we break it apart and we put it in the in the for the soup and you know it it, it flavors the soup but I couldn't I couldn't get that online so whatever so I'm going to only take half of the half of this spinach for the soup oh, put the rest pop back into the fridge hello kitty all right we need um, my chili sauce that I'll for flavor as well um, I also want to put in a, a, a zucchini. A zucchini that I have. So a zucchini, which is a little slimy, but it's fine. Um, and also what will go in is a packet of these one packet of these one packet of those okay because of because of late um uh, a lot of um ingredients and or produce and stuff uh, due to COVID has been um, sorry guys hang on a second bloody hell has been um, not available so Woolies have like these recipe options oh yeah true um, have these recipe options and um, where's yeah, I don't know. anyway have these recipe options and and 
you all you got to do is click on add all the ingredients to into the recipe but because of high demand on stuff right now a lot of those ingredients aren't um, available so what I did was I um, I looked at the recipe and was like okay so I'll take I'll take that off and not use that and and use this and you know and and just try and you know I know how to make a soup I just um, needed to know what ingredients that they wanted me to use so I can then order it online and, and get it to the get it to the uh, get it to the house okay so uh, First things first, I'm going to chop up this, I'm going to get a bowl, one of these bowls, let's put that over there for now, um, I'm just going to chop up this, I don't want that, um, just want to cut off the ends here, so I don't want the ends. They're all dirty. Just put those in there. Alright, let's um, bite sized pieces. And they'll they'll get really nice and soft in there. a lot of, that's, like, that's a lot, but, hmm, that is a lot, isn't it? I don't think that's all going to fit in this little thing. But, oh, we'll stuff it in there. Oh, it'll fit. Just. Nope, oh, don't want that. And what, what my brother usually does is he uses leeks, but I went to go on and look if there was any leaks and there was no leaks no leaks at all I mean I got a bunch of leaks here in the roof but um <laughs> no leaks couldn't get leaks leaks are good too I'm gonna actually clean this off a little bit it's a little slimy a little slimy Cut that off and that off. Mm. Best way to cut a zucchini is down the middle, down the middle again, and then just bite sized pieces into quarters. for that. We'll also add the frozen vegetable into that. As well. Now, all right. That's just like a few, few carrots. Mm. 
And so tomorrow, if I want another, if I want some more, I can just, I can just put the heat heat it with the with the frozen veg in because they're quite they're quite cooked already. Um, they're already soft. Okay. All right. So I will be uh, using. So I'm not actually I'm not actually making a lot of soup. I'm just making a couple of nights soup and stuff. Maybe I could put it in the freezer for later. Um, So let's uh, let's go on let's go on over over here to this part of the kitchen. Just put that straight in. Okay. All right. That's just to get it started. Now we need. To... Always does that to me. I don't know why it does that? All right. Let's just heat that water up first. Pull this in. We might need some more water in later. All we really want to do now is just try and get chicken flavour and spices and all that sort of stuff into the into the water. Now, um, I probably will add another cup of water soon, but I just want to get this chicken in there. Alright, let's pump all that in without getting splashbacks. Oh, come on. Come out. There we go. Alright, cool. Just this to break up this chicken here a bit. As you can see, the chicken's already cooked. Um, with this kind of chicken, usually you would just, um, oh, it's really hard to break up, isn't it? Um, with this kind of chicken, you would just usually, um, put in the oven for, why is it not breaking apart? Whatever. There we go, break that apart. In the oven for however many minutes it tells you. Why are you not breaking? It's like it's a fucking drumstick there. I don't know. That's weird. Anyway. Look at that flavour already. Look, I mean, that colour looks great. Alright, now, all we want to do right now is just cook the chicken. Just cook it so it kind of falls off the bone. Uh, and we're going to add nice big dollop of my chili sauce in there to actually there we go so that's the only that's the only kind of seasoning I'll ever put in this because this has got like garlic and ginger and and um, uh, just a bunch of flavour. Yeah, it's got huge flavour in that. I'm not going to take all the ingredients. I just spice myself. Anyway, so just get that to the boil and let it simmer there for you know however long. So lately I've been eating a lot of vegan products and these chips, these veggie chips, chili chips are bloody amazing. Um, they are vegan. Um, I'm not a vegan as you can tell I'm making chicken here. But I do like a lot of vegan products due to the fact that they don't have preservatives, 
or GM ingredients or artificial colors or flavors. Uh, this is gluten free. It's also dairy free, egg free and nut free. You know, this is, these chips are so bloody tasty. Mm. Mm. Good. This soup is good for cold. Or if you have COVID. I mean, I know you can't have my chili sauce, but if you want, you can add, you know, add the ingredients that some some of the ingredients like garlic and, and ginger and chili. That's how my brother makes it. He just adds, adds those three ingredients and it's great. All right, let's turn this down just a tad. I don't want I don't want it bubbling too much. I just want it hot. That's good. That's a good simmer right there. Right now I'm just cooking just cooking the chicken. The chicken doesn't need much cooking already. I mean, it's all, like I said, it's already cooked. But I'm just trying to get the, all the flavors in from the chicken into the into the stock and the water. It's actually probably a good idea to add some more water, because um, I'm also thinking about when the when the vegetables go in, we might actually add another cup. Uh, when the vegetables go in, they need that little bit of extra water. So that's all right. That's the stuff. The flavor's still in there. The water's not going to um, dilute that flavor that's in there. It's just gonna make room for the vegetables. All right, just uh, doing my normal, you know, take a picture and um, is it? It's not raining. I don't think so. Is it raining or is it just the heat from the... I don't know. I can never tell sometimes. I can hear the, the roof expanding. Alright. Alright, so, so I think the first... The first load of um, vegetables are going in now. That's these vegetables. Oh crap. You know what I'm going to do? Because I know for a... For, for, I know that that there is just going to splash, so I'm going to grab this ladle and just place them, place them in. Come on. Let's place in the vegetables, get them all nice flavour of some, oh gosh. Get on the ladle. So zucchini in first because that'll that needs cooking more than the, the spinach will. The spinach will go in last. And I mean this chicken soup will probably only take maybe an hour to cook. More than like when like doing um like soups that take for like three four hours because the flavor is already in there you know I like to cook easy right. that'll do right. That's it. I'll keep this ladle out though because that can that can be you know used to do this as well I might just use this Alright, so let's uh, turn that up just a bit. 
So yesterday my plumber came a little bit early. It is the 1st of February today, actually. Um, and yesterday my plumber came and put in the back um, hose, which was great. And he f finished up the ensuite. Um, and also, ah, oh, while, 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 that's, while that's doing that, I'll show you some cool things that's, that's been happening. So just let that go. So he cut the red bit there out for me, and now that's a little shelf for the kitchen. And on the other side, it's, you know, ah! It's a it's a backing for. Uh, I still need to I still need the tools to put it in there properly, but that looks really cool. I think that looks awesome. Um, so that's now a little feature for the kitchen, a little red background, um, and uh, all right. There's a kitty cat. I don't know where if we can go down there but can I zoom? Can I zoom? Zoom. That's where the new tap is in the backyard. So there's golfers. I don't want to be out there when there's golfers out there. Um So that, that red backdrop is the same backdrop that you have, the splashback that's in the, um, in the ensuite. They're already pretty soft. Alright. Time to get this spinach in. So let's just get that in there like that. Now, the steam will So I want to put the lid on there for the water in there to steam that those uh, that spinach, right? And, and that will shrivel down a little bit and so then I'll then emerge it into the water oh shit <laughs> so on other notes check out this really cool bruise I got on Australia Day I don't know how the heck I did it but I did it look at that fucking hell it's even down there like from there all the way up. I don't know what I did. <laughs> I'm always bruising myself. I bruise so fucking easily. Okay, just get like that. That's cool now. Don't need the lid anymore. Just get this wooden spoon and we'll uh, try and Smells delicious. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say about, I'm gonna cook that for an uh, extra 20 minutes, I think. So. Sure, 20 minutes. Starting. 
Starting now. So I'm just going to cook that for 20 minutes, but I'm going to turn it down again. Just keep the heat in there, just don't overdo it. We just want to soften the, the, the vegetables. Running out a lot. Um, I wonder if I if I did this just real quick, just to brighten up. See, yeah, it brightens up that kind of. So there we go. Look at all that flavour running around. I can see bits of chicken and vegetables, corn. Oh, and yesterday, oh man, yesterday, oh, you should see the sunburn I got yesterday. Um, let's pull this up for a second. Alright, so, yesterday, um, I'll be in the light, so if I go around, you can, oh, it's actually not too bad right now. I mean, compared to, compared to my, actually, yeah, compared to my white skin, there and there's the burn <laughs> and maybe the other side as well like but I always I don't know how much you will see of it but I always burn the back of my neck always always gets done anyway um, just, just, uh, it's really th it's really thick Look, there's some of that chicken it's coming right off the bone now. That's what I want. So I don't want any of that bone. Really, I don't really want any of that bone in there. But the bone will also give flavour too. Not too much. That's too much. I love gas. Gas is the best. It's like... Instant... Instant heat. Um, with electric. It's like... You go, oh, I'm going to turn it down to medium, but it slowly goes down to medium because you've made it, that made the hot plate so hot. So it will slowly get there. And then you want to, you've turned it down too low. So you want to bring it back up again. And it takes its time to come back up again. But with this, you just, like, straight heat, you know, straight boiling. You know, it's great. I fucking love gas. Gas is the best invention ever. Electric, electric ovens, electric stoves, you can go and suck my fucking left in that testicle. Seriously, seriously. Like, fucking hell. I'm gonna have to fucking bleep that out. God damn it. This looks superb. Already five minutes down. I just want to see. Oh, yum. Actually, what I will do is I want to do a taste test. I'm going to get a bowl that I will use for tonight. But I'll get some of that juice there. I just did. Alright. Put that in the bowl, let it cool down a bit, and then I'll uh, and then I'll taste it. And see what what else it needs. It might need some salt. It might need some pepper. We'll find out. Let it cool. It's just I'm just uh, over there. It's over here cooling. Um, so once that's cooled, I'll get a spoon and have a little taste. Now I'll just be able to put that that back into the into the mix. And this is this is where you start to put in like other ingredients only if you need to. It's still pretty hot.
Oh, that was good. I'm just trying to think, what does what does it need? <coughs> what does it need? I don't even. Uh, I might add a bit of salt to it. I'll add it to this just to just to see. But the thing is, that salt might only need to go in the bowl won't we? <coughs> when you're done. <coughs> bit of chili down the throat. Yeah, it doesn't need salt. No. I mean, it's good though. Mmm. I was going to put it back in there, but it's so tasty. I mean, maybe. Yes. Salt at the end. Don't put salt in here. Put salt in your bowl when you're ready to eat. I think that's the plan. We're only down to a couple of bars on the uh, Sony at the moment, so um, I'm gonna give. I think I think it's done. I think we're I think we're ready to eat. Actually, it doesn't need uh, the 20 minute time time limit that I just gave it not long ago. Um, I'm gonna have a look at what time it is right now. We're gonna say about 10 minutes. So that was that's 10 minutes done. I'm gonna turn the heat off. Um, I'm going to grab the ladle and I'm going to serve um, into bowl over here. Okay. I, I, it's it's quite an early dinner for me, but uh, I don't know. Let's get some of that chicken. Oh yeah. Let's get some uh, vegetables and more chicken. Ah, oh, that hot. Oh, that hot. That very hot. All right. Uh, just now we just want some some juice in there. Some juice. Okay, that's cool. That's hot doll. Hot. Okay, I just want to try and get some more vegetables more than chicken right now. Oh, there we go. I think that'll do it. Perfect. Lid on top. And later, I can then... Uh, okay, so let's come back over here. Put you guys up over there. Chips can go there, that can go over there. This can come over here. Alright, so um, I'm going to take a photo of this. So, alright, so here we go, guys. Um, for you, here we are. The chicken soup, chicken chili ginger garlic soup, best for colds, sore throats, anything like that. Um, but it's also her time to eat as well. So while my food is cool, uh, cooling down before I eat it, I'm going to feed you little miss. Huh? Hungry? Hungry? Might as well feed her on camera too, eh? You should see what she gets to eat. Yum. All right. We got some meaty ones. You thought you hadn't finished all the rest of them, but there we go. I don't know where Tiger is. Tiger! Tiger puss. Come on, look. Here. You can't have my food. Go back. Yummy whiskers. Alright, key cat. Oh, there you are. 
We're gonna go say hello to Tiger. Tiger's now eating her dinner. Oh, aren't you Tiger? Oh, such a cutie. And then we're about to feed Bella. So, um, let's get that over there. All right, so, need a tin of plates. And we need to go and grab Are you getting the rest of this? Oh, you're getting the rest of this, puppy. Chicken. Alright, there you go. Dinner's up. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. She eating dinner. All right, all right, back to my dinner, and now I'm about to eat that. So, on that note, you know what to do hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, share, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. <laughs>